Hello, and welcome back to Democracy Blood Bowl. After the last episode, uh, we, uh, meaning me and Twitch chat, decided on a theme. The Skaven team is now celebrities, meaning rat-based stuff together with celebrities. Easy. Meaning we now have a rat ogre called Taylor Swift. Excellent. Uh, that's all you need to know for the intro. <laughs> Well, um, past me will explain the rest of it. I will see you after the game to go over uh, what Twitch chat voted for when it comes to upgrades to the team. Okay, let's see. What, what are we up against? Uh, uh, let's see. You know, four big unblockers, four blitzers, one thrower, two linemen. Two reroll, four dedicated fans. They do have a mighty blow tackle piece, which is uh, not what we want. <laughs> Angelina Jobri, but it's it's too cheesy. Do I ever play the Warhammer? Are you like fantasy battle, or are you thinking total war? Because uh, uh, mostly I don't. Yeah, Safed, we uh, we have a Taylor Swift right here. Uh, no, I I uh, so one of the reasons I started playing tabletop or uh, Blood Bowl specifically was I'd started university and and I joined uh, one of my uh, my one of my classmates invited me to play uh, role playing games which I hadn't before. Long story short, he was also part of like a, a, a like a board game club. Well, it wasn't necessarily board game at the time because board game got big later on, but it was just like you know Warhammer Fantasy Battle that kind of stuff. And they play they played a lot of like 40, 40k and Warhammer Fantasy, and I was like, oh, this is intriguing at least to a point, but. I was like, it's too many minis to paint, and I can't afford to buy them all. And uh, my friend was like, well, have you heard about Blood Bowl? <laughs> I just saw Brunost Mars be suggested, and it's very funny if you know what Brunost is. And so that's how I started. I was like... Oh, so I need I need less uh, less figures for this. Cool, that sounds good. And then after that, I uh, let's see. What do I want? I think I want more gutter runners than not. Uh, yes. Hmm. Sorry, I have to figure out how I want to do this now that I have four of these. That's a lot. Hey bribes for everyone uh, I think this means I I pull back a bit actually Okay, uh, I think we are gonna do this. 
because it's a one chance to hit it. Uh, we didn't get it. That's very sad. Let's go. Get rid of it. Uh, but I didn't do anything. So, I went for the bribe there because I wanted to do this pass. If I'd gone for the... Uh, if I'd gone for the, um, for the argue the call, and it would have ended my turn, even if, if, like, if I succeeded. Uh, okay, that's a good scatter for us. V-Man, subscribe to Prime, thank you so much. Welcome back to, to the subscribe, well, welcome to subscribers. <laughs> Red Leader Gimmis. David Ratzeloff. Ichi Kuto, is that someone who uh, watches a lot of Blood Bowl on Twitch? I don't recognize the name in this regard. Okay, so we got we got a stun. Also, I have a spare, so I I am incentivized to keep fouling if I can, right? Hey. Hey, keep it easy on the cheese puns. It's yeah, like I'm I'm being I'm being nice cuz it's the big birthday stream, but uh cheese puns are not without controversy. Have I talked about the reason for um the uh, uh the cheese pun ban? Right, and wh why they were banned. And I guess officially still are. Oh, cool. So then I actually have to pay attention to what I'm doing. I, I hate it. <laughs> so the, the, the main reason for the cheese ban was that whenever, well, it were twofold. The, the obvious one was that whenever you were playing Skaven, and we were doing, like, theme names, everyone just wanted to do cheese puns. And all of the Skaven teams at the time were essentially just like, yes, hello, welcome to, uh, we do cheese puns now. And it was a bit boring, but the actual, the proper, like, proper, proper main reason was that, uh, with cheese puns being banned... People were really, and some people were really annoyed, and it rallied people together around a a stupid cause rather than rally around. Enjoy your democratic birthday, smiley face. <laughs> other other stupid causes, if that makes sense. <laughs> Thank you, Sakura. Uh, welcome back, to subscribers, dude. So it was always just to. Uh, uh, to make sure people were like, um... Oh, that's a bummer. I don't like that. Um... Or rallying against weird stuff rather than... Annoying stuff. Okay. Rassle, rassle, rassle. Uh, what's your range? Okay, your range is almost there. Um, if I manage this, yeah, that still kind of works. Okay. Um,
actually. You want to be here, and you want to be here. Oh, we got it. Uh, I was really hoping to uh, to get over here, uh, but I didn't. Well, that made me sad. That's fine, though. The, the dictators were, like, way later. Like, cheese puns were banned, like, I'd say Blood Bowl 1. Party animals were Blood Bowl 2. Like, I've been doing this for a really long time. <laughs> Again, officially it's my birthday tomorrow. I appreciate all of the well wishes though. It's just, it made the theming of the stream a lot easier because I'm not streaming tomorrow. So let's see how they want to do this. I'm assuming this guy's going to run over here. And I'm assuming this is blitzing this. The the fact the fact that the fact that uh, Le Jerk is the one uh, trying to riot that you guys are being lied to is funny because he knew all along. He's com he's coming to have like birthday beers tomorrow evening at a pub. He knew chat. He was in on the whole thing. Okay. Um, well. So, let's see. This is a 3 plus. And Yeah, the problem here is that I I need an assist here to do this blitz. And it has to be this. Okay. Okay, let's see how this goes. Not good. Yeah, we... <laughs> okay, we just stayed a straight up s a snake eyed it. We're all the one into a one. Which, admittedly, was probably better than the alternative. Uh, but that's rough. That's really rough. See what happens. Okay, that's anything that keeps our rat standing here is good. 
Unfortunately, this is free to blitz. So we're definitely in a lot of trouble, but I think we would be in a lot of trouble regardless of how, where the snake eye had happened, right? Henry Cavill's Warhammer TV show should be Blood Bowl. It should be. It's, I, I genuinely think it's like they're, I think uh, the Blood Bowl Old World setting is like the best setting well that i mean outside of like rogue trader in 40k but rogue trader in 40k has a problem of uh, uh they're being part of the fan base not realizing that it's satire <laughs> and i don't think that's the case with blood ball i think everyone's kind of on board with what the satire is Okay. Oh, they didn't get it. Oh, they got it. Okay, so now they have this free. And this is still free, right? But they're down to one reroll, so at least that's uh, something. Oh, they got it, unfortunately. Oh, that's bad. Two dudes out is 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 just not good enough. Uh, I keep saying stuff like this, but it's. Uh, okay, at least that's something that we can do. No, fuck. Th uh, hmm. Okay, this is. Uh, this is going to require uh, a lot of luck. Oh, and I... Well, not anymore, because I fucked it up. Uh, okay. Okay, so we are in uh, we are in three plus territory. In case that wasn't clear, and we snake eyed again. Forgotten how sad this game makes you when you snake eye. Yeah, now they're getting the hits in. I don't know if there was anything. Well, no. Like, we snake eyed, so it wouldn't have mattered even if we somehow managed to do even riskier stuff and clear the ball. Like, it's. There are, th there are three dudes out. We can't do anything about that. We need to get the ball on a gutter runner. And we need that gutter runner to run the fuck away. Which was possible here. It was a 3 plus into a 3 plus handoff. And then a 2, uh, two plus dodge out. And then we'd be up here. And they wouldn't be able to catch us. Um, but that is no longer the case, obviously. And they got it. But they went here rather than... Oh, no. Actually, it's still in two tackle, rat tackle zones. But this means this guy can just shove it here. This is a bit weird, though. Because this... I guess... 
I guess he really wanted to scatter the ball, which again seems odd to me. Because these guys are actually really good at catching, like, they're much better at catching a scatter than anything else, right? So if it scatters here, we're okay. It didn't. Actually, if it, sca if, if it scatters here, we're great. Like, they're gonna hit it. Yeah, this is still true. If it scatters this way, we're good. Because they don't have anyone to pick the ball up with now. So they might not even take this hit. They did. Okay, that's... I thought it was a smart play not to take it, because it's gonna scatter into a position that's better for me. Yeah. This isn't great, but it is better. Okay, this is very strange. Like, putting these, like, covering all of this just means that this, again, scattering is better for me. Because I can, in theory, recover it. I mean, it doesn't look like I will, but I might. I have to stand these guys up. I think this is what I have to do. Scatter this way. Uh, no. No. Scatter this way. No. No. Scatter. Yep. Oof. Dude, come on. <laughs> I mean, dude, that was a four plus. Uh, and that, that turn, we had... We got, like, almost everything we needed. Except for the... We even got a better scatter. Uh, it was only a a four plus pickup. The reason I wasn't re-rolling it is because I needed the re-roll like afterwards. And like I said, if you f if you fail it, it's still a fifty percent chance to get it the second time. And I didn't think that was good enough for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like this is everything's gone to shit, pretty much. Uh, we're gonna lose all of our gutter runners, and we're not gonna be able to pick the ball up. Um. But that's what happens when you snake eye two turns in a row. <laughs> like, the only thing that's helping me currently is that my opponent has clumped everyone together, which, again, I think is good for me it, when it comes to, like, actually getting the ball. It's obviously not good for me right now because they get to hit all my rats. But being able to recover the ball and move out, I think this is good for me. Because I'm never going to be able to block these guys down, right? But if everyone's just in a big clump, I am probably able to push someone into the ball. Uh, they're going to pick the ball up now, though. And that's... Th the other problem with this, right, is that I have three KOs, so I'm not going to... I'm not going to be able to get them back in the second half, and then we have to try and steal the ball somehow. So this is looking like another loss, unfortunately. Um... 
I think part honest I to me part of the problem is that we have to you've you've given me like way too many gutter runners. Cause they can't they can't stand up and uh you know, do shit essentially. But that's your prerogative. If that's what you want to do, that's what you want to do. Uh, well, obviously, we're not getting out of this, right? Um, hmm. Yeah, this is what I want to do first. It's not going to work, but nope. I roll a lot of threes though when I when it's harder, which is uh, funny. Your record is 12 ones in a row. Triple skull, reroll, triple skull, the next turn, triple skull, <laughs> reroll. That's very impressive. I'm, I'm like trying to figure out if there's anything left for me to do. Yeah, I mean, there is obviously, but. No. No, 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 no. Nope. Well, we have one less gutter on her now, so... Wait, I rolled exactly the same thing again? Damn. Uh, okay, so... It's... No, that doesn't work. Uh, you can't get there. Okay, cool. Oh, you should have actually gone up. If you go up here, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, sure. Oh, and I just fucked it, didn't I? Yes, I did. There's no point in doing that, though. Like, I don't gain anything by doing any of this. <laughs> that was probably for- No! Wait! Did I, I snake eyed again? It, well, the thing is, I normally I, w I don't mind having four gutter runners, but having four gutter runners with no skills uh, means that you can't, I can't really do anything with them, right? Because as soon as I put the next to something with block, 
they're going to get knocked down. And I don't need them to score, right? Because uh, I don't need to cover them. I'm, I'm just going to be up here, hand it off, and then we'll run it in. And that's fine. Uh, but having four gutter runners with essentially no skills, right? Because diving tackle can be fun, but it's literally not doing anything, right? Because all this does here is that it's a free hit. So, yes, having having this many gutter runners right now is extremely difficult. Especially since it's also hard for me to get SPP on them because it's spread over four different pieces. So I have to keep X. I have to make extra sure I know where each gutter runner is. Okay, let's see how the foul goes. We don't have an Apo, so we're probably going to be down another gutter runner here. Oh, this... Oh, I was going to say, that this lets me foul that guy. But no. It's fine, though. It's not... It's not my team, it's your team. They don't, they don't have spares, no. So. It does mean I get to blitz this dude. That's obviously not good enough. Unfortunately, it's at McClawley Culkin, the best gutter on her name. That's out. We'll see. It depends on how how well these KO rolls go. Oh, they are... It's looking like they're doing a, a blitz without rerolls. So there's a slim chance they don't score here. Admittedly, they can easily get a three die here. So you don't expect... Like, I think this is still correct. But there's a slim chance. Turned out to be no chance. are on the floor yeah that's not good not good enough and we need like we need a blitz and we need to steal the ball we have we do not have enough of anything to deal with this unfortunately but it is going to let us play like super duper aggressively until until we run out of everything Okay, this is, this is extremely weird because if we were to get a blitz, this just means uh, we can run through and, and steal the ball. Unless, of course, that happens. And, yep. I'm going to get something more to drink.
I heard we go another KO. Yep. You're in range, right? Yep. The only thing that stops them here is that they want in on the pickup and it scatters like here. But hopefully we'll get through this game quickly and then... Um, and we can go, we can go next essentially. I oh Cool. Fail that pick up. Oh. Nope. Okay. Let's see, we <laughs> right. <laughs> We're down to eight. Let's see. We're gonna have to like they since they stole the ball, right? We act they don't have to score here. So I think So the good news here is that this doesn't change anything, right? Holy shit, we broke armor.
Okay, Apple. <laughs> yep. Let's go smash knee. Yeah, like I it's I'm I'm outnumbered. I have nothing to do. They gave me a one die into a one die. I don't I like I genuinely don't know why they did that. Cuz that and then of course I like I'm not expecting this to to die or get hurt. I just want it off the pitch. And it was definitely worth the one reroll. Yep, someone <laughs> decided not to be on the side of the pitch. I mean, it's they're going to beat the shit out of me, but we <laughs> we also didn't get any SVP for that, but Oh, wait, if they do this, they can't get back? Well, they can with a rush. But. And they got it. This is still a rush. Oh, but they're going to follow up here, of course. No, but that... Well, I guess. Okay. Uh. Oh, I should have I should have dodged. That was bad pathing by me. Okay, didn't matter. I think I think this has to blitz this, right? Uh, that's not what they did. I get no. This can come through here. I hadn't. Re yeah, that's right. So this just comes back and murders this, and then they're free to deal with this. So it should be fine. Unless this stays put, because if this goes through here, this ends up here, and if this is then a push, it'll end up here. Or here, depending on where this guy goes. There's probably a way out of Like, there's probably an easy way out of it that I'm not seeing instantly. Yeah, because now this guy... Well, that doesn't change anything, right? This always ends up here.
Oh, wait, can you do... No, you can't do it the other way around, because there's... Well, you can. Like, you just need an assist here, and then you put this here, and then this removes this, and then... Pfft, everything's gone. But then they have to run these guys back, which is probably fine, right? Oh, that car is right. It was about sending a message. Oh, nope, they're not... They're doing something else. Okay, let's uh, let's assume like they're gonna knock these guys down. Yep. Where where are you gonna go? With what support? I guess these two. Okay. Then what? So that only worked because uh, they got her both down. But, okay, I mean, sure. It doesn't matter, right? This is still a two die uphill. Yep. Let's go. This is a two plus. Uh, this isn't even, I think this is, this isn't even easy to clear, right? You just blitz this corner and push these guys away. You also have like a two die here, if you want. I'm no, I like. I I don't know what the AI is like in Blood Bowl Three. I've never played against like the only time I played against the AI was a bit in Blood Bowl One, and. Then I played like two two of the intro parts, like the tutorial parts in Blah Blah 2. Outside of that, I have no idea. I know that the the Eternal League and campaign play is better in Blood Bowl 2 than it is in Blood Bowl 3. But if you're honestly, if you if you're thinking of buying Blood Bowl, you should be playing against other people. Because that's where the fun is. If if you're like if you're a dad home on like um parental leave and you need something that's like offline and you because you can play like 10 minutes at a time fine but in that case i it shouldn't matter either way right so just get like blood bowl 3 if it's i think it's half price at the moment somewhere um so like ai in blood bowl games as i understand it is like really hard so but for the most part, you shouldn't be playing against the AI. Okay, wait. Ah, oh, the. I was gonna say this gives me um this gives me one die, but it doesn't. 
<laughs> well, okay. I haven't got a single... No, not a single badly hurt. Wait, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, it's not up. So the problem here, the the problem here, because it is that right. So I have to cut this corner, regardless. So it's fine. Oh, I used the reroll and rolled a two again. Cool. Yeah, like, <laughs> I like that, like, looking back at the, like, the Blood Bowl 2020 rules, someone was like, you know what, we should, we should nerf, uh, we should nerf the, um, uh, the Mighty Blow, um, Claw interaction, but we should also make the casualty, ta uh, the injury table, much more deadly. Which I think is a fun compromise. It just means that... Oh, okay, well, now the, uh, the Agile teams are, like, even just worse at pretty much everything than they were before. Snake Eye? Snake Eye! No, oh, there'd be no animation if you Snake Eye. I think this means we have to start fouling here, because uh, I need to protect my players. Well, that didn't work. Uh, we we're not like we're not gonna be able to, to get any SVP on our one turn. We don't have enough players, and these guys are clearly not coming back, right? Thanks, also Vic. Like this was just one of those games where it's like once we, uh, once we uh, double snake eyed, we we didn't really have a way back, and it's a question of like damage mitigation. And uh, honestly, this isn't too bad. It just sucks, but we're not in a position where we can comp compete with this. Actually, if they keep it like this, we are. But I 
blitz the wrong rat. They needed to blitz this one. Okay. I guess they could score now. That seems... Not super smart. They got what they needed. So I have to do the... I have to do the one dot... Uh, do I? Yes, I do, right? Because this is a... Uh, this is a four plus, three plus, two plus. And out. This is the frustrating bit, right? The game, <laughs> three plus, three plus, two plus, and we still weren't allowed to do anything. Just push no, these guys were already in range. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, the rat ogre is back. So I think this means we get to do a vanity pass here. Actually, no, this means we get to try a uh, one-turner, doesn't it? It does. I was so sure I wouldn't get the Rat Ogre back, so I didn't even save my rerolls for it. Let's see. Donk, donk. You go here. That's fine. Sure. Again, I don't have... And it's a deep kick. Uh, so that means I have to pass to that, probably. Uh... If we roll a one here, that's like, it's fine. We wouldn't have made it anyways. Ooh.
Okay. <sighs> I think it's that. Okay, here we go. So that's a 3 plus 3 plus 2 plus 2 plus. <laughs> we failed the f we failed the first one. Hello, it's kind of present me again. Now, since uh, the end of the game, uh, let me recap what Twitch chat voted for. First of all, the move busted gutter honor is now gone. He got kicked, unfortunately. The uh, wrestle uh, line rat uh, that randomed wrestle uh, got another random uh, and now has wrestle and pro. And finally, uh, Twitch chat decided to be nice to me uh, for once and save the money for other things. Uh, so at least we have some money in the bank. And that is all that Twitch chat voted for. I'll see you in the next one. We're not out of the woods yet. We're, uh, we've got a few challenging games coming up, but I'll see you in the next one.